Life is hard. Quarantining is harder. A new normal has settled across the country as people everywhere have learned that if you can't be with the one you love, love the one you're with. Time to start your work. So, what? You weren't wearing that at breakfast. I changed my mind. One outfit per day. Go change. You're still here. Tell me a story. I've told you three this morning already. Please. Okay. There once was a mom who told so many stories she threw up. The end. <laughs> now go get your iPad. <laughs> Gross. Hey, Jamie. Nine days. Nine days. Until school's out. Oh, I thought you said their last day was next Friday. Well, I'm not counting weekends, and Friday's a field day, so that doesn't count. Okay. <laughs> oh. I know, you have to go. No, it's just a work email. What's wrong? You usually rush me off the phone when you're working. I've set some boundaries for my work. <laughs> okay. What? I have. We'll see how long that lasts. Whatever. I gotta go. Mm-hmm. I'm taking the dogs for a walk. I'll talk to you later. Bye. No. Boundaries, Lauren. Boundaries. Oh. Hey, Adam. I was just about- Did you read that email? No, I'll check it when I get- Oh, home. no, you should read it right now. Why? What's going on? There's a mandatory meeting where they're announcing the new VP. What? Wait, I thought Carson- Carson is gone. Tim Baxter canned every last one of them yesterday. Oh, they must have really screwed up to get the CEO to step in. I tried to tell them. Well, who's taking over our team? We'll find out in a few minutes, which is why I'm calling. Let's get our ducks in a row now. Okay, what do you need me to do? Check the folders. I don't think Carson was keeping up the reports. All right, I'm on it. I'll check the monthly data and have Cameron do a forecast. Let's talk after the meeting. Okay, sounds good. Bye. Happy birthday. Lauren, I'm calling to tell you that we are postponing my birthday. Okay, sure. We can celebrate later if you want. Yeah. It's just, you know, it, it's just too crazy here and I'm really fine with it. No big deal. I'm sure it will be fine. I love you. And I don't want you to worry. I am okay. All right? Okay. I just, I really, I have to get back to okay. work. Fine. I love you. Bye. Okay, Daniel. Hey, I got the cat stroller. I'm on my way. Okay, good. Um, I have another delivery for you to make after that delivery. Emma, the market's up today. I gotta get back to trading. I know, it's just these people have come to rely on us to run their errands, and they are also paying us, so... Okay, what is it? I'm gonna need you to pick up some balloons and take them to 22103 West Walnut. Balloons? Balloons are not a necessity. They are if you were five years old. I don't want to do this all day. Please, please, I will love you forever. Okay, but you're killing me. Thank you. All right, I love you. I'll talk to you in a bit. Okay, bye. bye. Hey, Cameron, what's up? Emma, do you know what you need? Oh, God, <laughs> I don't need a puppy. But his name is Biscuit and Ruben needs a friend. Okay, my landlord won't let me have another dog, but I really, really hope that you find a good home for him. And will you talk to Daniel? I love you. I love the dog. I love the dog more. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Sorry, bye. Ugh. Adam. Do you need a dog? Uh, no, I need you to do a forecast based on the new data I just uploaded to the server. I thought we weren't working. Well, you thought wrong. Also, there's a mandatory meeting that starts in a couple minutes. Yeah, I'm not going to make it to that or the interview. Interview? What are you talking about? They want to interview me for the senior manager position. Wait, how did you get an interview? Look, I will do the forecast for you this time, but honestly, my life is just moving in a different direction, and I don't have time for these things anymore. When is your interview? That is what I'm trying to tell you. I'm not interviewing for it. Whatever. Just get me the forecast as soon as possible and be on that call. Got it? Fine. 
show me the dog again. No, bye. Hello, marketing and communications teams. Thank you for joining us. You know, first off, I wanted to put to rest the rumors by telling you that the contract that we had with, with Carson and Associates is, is expired. And although we appreciate their contributions, we just decided not to renew the agreement. What? You didn't renew because they didn't know what they were doing. Now, on to more important news. I'm excited to announce the new vice president of marketing is... Dave Mahoney. Dave? Oh, not Dave. Who cares? Dave would like to say a few words. Thanks, Tim. I'm excited to take on this new challenge. And I appreciate those of you who really stepped up over the past couple of months. Ugh. I know things have been tough, but some have not used their time as wisely as others. The days of barely checking emails and missing meetings are over. <laughs> okay. But together, I think we can right this ship and increase our numbers. And so let's get back to work, people. Okay. Can you believe that? Unbelievable. We were trying to work. Did Cameron tell you they want to interview her for Dave's old job? When's your interview? I haven't actually. You didn't get an interview? Of course I got an interview. It's probably just in my spam folder. Oh, Adam. Don't worry about me. Tell me about the folders. Are the reports done? You were right. They didn't do any of them. Really? Well, you're going to have to pull an all-nighter to update them. Um, actually, I'm trying to create a better work-life balance, so... Lauren, this is not the time to check out. We need to make hay while the sun is shining. Of course. You're right. Okay, I'll work as fast as I can. I got it. And I'll call Dave to congratulate him. Good idea. Um, tell him I said hi. Uh, yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay, bye. Adam, how can I help you? Dave, I wanted to congratulate you on your return to the company and your new position. Oh, thanks. Hey, I was thinking of applying for the manager position and wondered what- We're not really accepting applications. You're not? Tim thinks we should choose from a list the Carson team gave him. Well, that doesn't really make any sense, does it? I mean, having to listen to the Carson guys, they don't even work Okay, okay, anymore. okay, I'll interview you. But I'm gonna need you to get your team back on track. Our team is already on it. See, I'm already ahead of the game, your so- interview was at 4.30. Perfect. Thanks so much. Yes! Hey there. I just found out that Alexa School is looping next year. What's looping? The kids have the same teacher every year. Alexa could have Ms. Cross for the next four years. Ouch. I'm toast. I think it's time you mend the fence with Ms. Cross. Yeah, I hate contention. <sighs> Listen, I gotta get these reports done. There she is. Welcome back, Lauren. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Adam, I'm almost done with March. You're still in March? Do you have any idea how much work these are? I was hoping you'd have April done in the next hour. <laughs> what? That's impossible. I'd like for Dave to see how efficient we are. Just tell him the Carson guys didn't do the reports. Look, this could be the difference between me getting the manager job and some outside- But I really didn't want to work that late anymore. Thanks, Lauren. Appreciate you being the team player. Love that about you. Bye. No. Yeah, Mom. Daniel, I just wanted to let you know that we are not celebrating my birthday today. Oh yeah, happy birthday. I mean, we're not, we're not canceling it, we're just postponing it for a few months. Okay, thanks for letting me know. And I, I, I don't want you to worry, okay? I'm fine. Okay, I'll try not to worry. I gotta go, I'm making deliveries. Okay, be careful. Yeah, okay, bye. Bye. Hello? Oh, what's wrong now? Miss Cross, I, I wanted to apologize for the misunderstanding we had a few weeks ago. 
there was no misunderstanding. You sent an inappropriate email. Right, right. Well, um, I'm sorry. Okay, I accept your apology. Thank you. So I heard Alexa will be in your class again next year. Yes, I'm excited to have those kiddos again. They're so talented. And, and, and by the way, Alexa's story was excellent. Did you like it? Because I wanted, well, I, I mean, Alexa wanted to um, write a story with a strong female lead. So, <laughs> Jamie, I know you wrote this story. I mean, it's actually very well done. Have you ever considered a career in writing? Not really. You should. Just stay away from the poetry. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Well, Alexa's butterfly poem was a little silly. She's a first grader. Of course it was silly. Yeah, well, she didn't write it, though, did she? Of course she wrote it. She rhymed the word polymorphic on her own. Well, I may have advised her on one or two words, but... I'm just saying she had help, which is why I took off points. And you calling her poem silly is exactly why I'm taking off points for your year end survey. Really? Really? I'll see you in September at some virtual back to school night. Oh, wait, no, 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 I'm sorry. I, I really didn't mean, oh. Yeah, Emma. Hey, uh, did you get my text? I told you I need to get back home. Okay, I know, but my old neighbor called desperate for his emotional support animal, Larry. So how could I say no? Uh, where is it? He's up north. I just drove to the south side. Now you want me to go back up north? Sometimes we do things for people that we love. Like I helped you study for your Series 7 exam. Okay, you're right. But listen, don't take any more today. Okay, no more. Zip. Zero. We are donezo. Call me when you pick up Larry. Okay. Okay? Love you. Bye. Hey Cam, uh, Adam said you were uploading the forecast? I didn't do it. Wanna know why? Cameron. I'm quitting my job. You're what? Do you remember that Pomsky that I rescued last week, the white husky mix? No. Okay, so anyway, I found his owner and we started talking and like one thing led to another. I don't, I don't need to hear this. <laughs> no, wait, he is going to help me start a rescue. You're kidding. No, he already has a building and he's going to help me set up a nonprofit. Wow. I know, isn't that great? So anyway, my last day is going to be next week. Yeah, but I can't do the reports without the forecast. Lauren, so there is more to life than doing reports that no one is going to read. Oh, listen, anyway, I gotta go. My next rescue has a bed appointment, okay? Bye. Bye. Hey, Lauren, what's up? Hey, Dad, do you have a minute? I have an idea. Well, sure, what are you thinking? This cannot be right. Hey, did you pick up Larry? Emma, the address is a reptile store. Yeah, that, that's right. Emma, what am I picking up? Larry. <laughs> The boa constrictor. What? You, you, don't worry. He is he is very nice and house trained. No, nope, I'm not he, doing this. But he's an emotional support animal. Daniel. I really am 
I'm fine. It's, it's just today. Carol, you told me that three times. And we're not canceling anything. We're just, you know, just postponing it. You're right again. Jeez, we haven't been to the park in ages. I remember that time we took the kids and Danny took a header into the pond. <laughs> and his shoes squished all the way to the corner. Yeah. I got your message. What happened? She called my poem silly. And you couldn't let it go. What is wrong with me? She even complimented my writing. She did? Yeah. I'm considering writing a children's book. Alexa loves my stories. That's a great idea. I think I'd really like it. You should go for it. Hey, I just got to the store, so can I call you later? Oh, your boss needs something. I love you. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I'm the best candidate because I have so much knowledge about the history of this company. I mean- Are you threatening me because I didn't read your stupid email? What? No, of course not. I'm saying that I just have a lot of knowledge that others don't. I mean, I'm a little surprised you would use this tactic. Everyone was taking it easy at the beginning of this thing. We were in shock. Dave, I'm, I'm not using any tactic. I'm just saying the company would benefit from what I know. Okay, listen, I'll recommend you for the position, but you can never speak of this again. Got it? Do you agree? Adam? I would never say anything. Okay. Are we done here? Oh, I, I thought that you were gonna hang up. And there it is. <laughs> there it is! <laughs> Melissa, hi. I have a business proposition for you. Are you interested? Great. It involves a system of helpfulness. All right, and $39.99. <laughs> just kidding. But are you a self-starter? So, I just decided that there are more important things in life than weekly reports. Good for you, sis. How about you? Did you get your trading done in time? I think I'm gonna be okay. They're down the street. Okay. <gasps> what is this? Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Mom! Guys, what's going on? You knew about this. <laughs> oh. Did you really think we'd let you celebrate your birthday without us? Aww. I love you guys. I love you, Mom. I love you. Aww. To, to mom. mom. The most smartest, most talented, wonderful woman I know. <clears throat> Stop it. Really. We did. Okay, okay. That's <laughs> 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 Look, pizza. <laughs> I love pizza. And Lauren well, we got cupcakes. You know, life just doesn't get much better than this, does it? Nope. No, it does not. <laughs> Let's eat. Hmm? Great, I'm starving. Okay. Mom, you go first. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Mike, you can only make two pieces. What are you talking? It's a party. His cholesterol was 170. Uh, can we not talk about this now? You know, I think it's important to let your children know how bad your health is. Oh. No, Mom, we don't need to know. Can I get a what what? Can I get a what what? Get a what what? What what? Can I get a boo boo? What what? What what? What what? What what? No no. Yes yes.
get a whoop 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 Can I get a thumbs up? Can I get a what what? Can I get a what what? Yes! <laughs> Go team!